On the Midwestern prairies of Illinois, unseen beneath high autumn corn, come the farmers of the future. A march of machines, agbots in prairie parlance, rolls its way through leafy crop rows, performing much of what farmhands do and more. Scientists at the University of Illinois and several other institutions are testing artificial intelligence technologies that are already being evaluated on farms worldwide. It's a win-win for everybody, right? The farmer makes more money, the soil and the environment is better off, we're sequestering more carbon whenever we can, and the consumer gets healthier, more organic, climate smart food. A small army of robots targets dry soil spots, weeds, and pest infestations, avoiding indiscriminate pesticide and herbicide use that leads to resistant weeds and bugs. And they measure which seeds fare better. Between seasons, farmers often lack the time and labor to plant cover crops that enrich the soil and protect against runoff into the water supply. But farm bots plant off-season crops between corn and soybean rows before they're even harvested. And robotic dogs walk where wheels can get tangled. Robots are very, they're eye candy, and so they tend to get most of the attention. Robots are just a fraction of all the things that we do. They install these at a depth of 50. There are buried sensors that record soil health and crop hydration. Livestock drones monitor cattle health, weight, and single out pregnant cows. Artificial intelligence is designed to make farming more productive, more environmentally sustainable, using better data, and not so much to replace human labor as to make it more effective. This 28-year-old farmer says new technologies can help with a growing field labor shortage and a crushing schedule. Planting occurs at the same time, um, spraying, harvest is all really at the same time. So we really do get in a labor crunch for, for very short um, but intense periods throughout the year. So um, things like automation are, are definitely a solution. With limited agricultural land in a growing global food crisis, researchers say the rise of robots and increasing automation seems inevitable. John Hendren, Al Jazeera, Champaign, Illinois. Make sure to subscribe to our channel to get the latest news from Al Jazeera.